Suchi. FNM trying to grab the lead back. Bounce pass up top with Suchi into the corner. Turned and fired the three to Nickelball. Had a couple opportunities not go his way in the first half. Maybe that will get him going. Nichols tried to penetrate in, then backs out. Bounce pass up top to Suchi, and he finds Gross with what? definitely keep your eye out on and I think that f and is going to keep the pedal to the metal at least when it comes to driving physically trying to draw those fouls. Grossless. Ball fake. Skips it out. Suchi. Three. Left wing. Yes. Being guarded by Josh Love. Gives it up top for Para. Para hands off to Seidman. Left elbow. Near side. Nichols. Down low. Para. Para spins on Kalora and goes up and scores. Grossless drives. Forty-three Bears lead. That type of slashing guard has given Franklin and Marshall trouble here over the last couple of games. And Wall finding some room in the paint. Nichols right elbow knocks. Diplomats trail by two. Grossless gives it up top of the circle to Charles. Left side Nwosia. Down the low blocks to Para. Para goes to work on Cole Grubbs. And score. Glad to have you with us today. Sideman with possession for the Diplomats. Mark Suchi wears number 22. Omar Nichols is number four. Down the low blocks. Para battles Harry Johnson. Goes up off the glass and came to Gettysburg after five years as the head coach at Vassar. Play number one. Para gives it off to Sideman. The lane layup. Grossless, Nichols, Suchi. Para and Seidman for Franklin and Marshall. It's Williams, Stafford, Shower, Badgie, and McKeon for the visit. Oh, Matt definitely have to be aware of that and going to need to commit some numbers to the defensive boards. Williams stands 6'6, six, six, Badgie stands 6'8, McKeon stands 6'7. Bullets with a size advantage. Here's Para. Goes to work on Elijah Williams, a left-handed. The Grubbs has really denied all access in there, and the OCS threes have really been the difference. Back. Well, I think that they just need to keep pounding it inside 18 points in the paint for them, and the defense and boards have been. First matchup, 27-26 at the break, then shot 54% from the floor in the second half. The win going away. Here's Nichols, three, finger. Hit the glass. A little late on that one. Simon at the other end for FNM. Trying to get the answer. He worked his way into the lane. And Trotter's got seven. This is not panicking right there. He's in a bad spot. Off balance. Still able to see the cutter. Jalen Green. Simon hands off to Jalen Green. As Green replaces Grossless. Green turn boards and five assists. Grossless will drive on Grubbs. Lays it up off the glass. Just under six a game. He's on the scoreboard, 21-19 Bears. Yeah, Marlon Wise, um, listed as a guard, but doing a lot more forwards work in this game. More of a two-way player can do both things. Guard and Suchi here. Nwosiet trying to work on Wall. Works his way in the paint. Draws two defenders. 
Inbounds pass comes in. Green goes driving. Pretty much one through five. It makes it even harder to get anybody loose. Nichols. Suchi. Three from the left wing. Get Nose he gets to take it in, throws it in the corner to Charles. Now Nose he gets down on the baseline, looking to back down Jaden Nixon. Trying to go up and under, gets Nixon in the air, draws the fat. Parra will inbounds to Charles near corner, back on the low blocks. Parra goes up, both teams defensively challenging everything. Para gets it into Suchi. Left wing for Seidman, hounded by Stewart. Seidman now works his way into the paint. Goes up off the glass and gets it together. There you see the athleticism of Jaden Nixon to close that out. Yeah, he made sure it didn't matter either way. Now five on the shot clock, but they do find an open man down. Against the Bears. Not too many complaints from the visitor's bench. Para, five of 14 from the field. Have it for 8 of 17, but 6 of 10 from beyond the arc. Grossless, lob pass. Parra gets position, goes 